noisy. The Sound and the Fury, starring Gail Williams. <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, you know what? We have people that talk about rotary pumps versus vibratory pumps mm -hmm. in the kitchen, the difference in noise. That isn't your problem in your kitchen, folks. It's the grinder. <laughs> yes, it is. So, what we're going to do today is we're going to test the decibels using my, your fancy decibel reader. My decibel reader, yeah. <laughs> so, we're going to check the decibels on various and sundry machines. Okay, um, and so. Let's be quiet here for a moment and just do the ambiance so down. we can start the same ambiance. Look at that free play thing. Okay, so that we're at about 45 ambiance. What's the difference between the top one and the bottom one? Oh, average and peak. Okay, this is peak, this is average. You mm -hmm. said it was 45. Okay. 45 is good. Okay, so we're at 45 just with the ambient sound in the room, and we're going to just go through and do several yep. grinders. I'm going to leave it right there, too. Okay. Mazer Mini. This is the E. Okay. So, so it's about 90. Yeah, exactly. Okay. And the peak was 100. All right. Or so. All righty. All right. Let's go get the Rocky grinder. Okay, the Rocky. Oops, you got to turn it on. It's about 85 on that guy. That's what it looked like to me. Okay. Okay, this is the uh, Melconic. Pro-Am Espresso. That's around between 87 and 88. It kind of went up to 90 once, but generally 87 and yeah. 88. It jumped up. I mean, it was jumping more, it looked like. Yeah. The volume of the noise. Okay. 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 The uh, uh, Nuovo Simonelli MCI. Up to about 90. Tops. Yeah, tops. It was generally hanging out in the 87, 88 range. Mm -hmm. Yep, 83 touch. Mm, about 85. 85. Yeah, yeah. 84, 85. 84, 85. That's the quietest so far. Okay, the Brimble Smart Grinder. Eighty-five, eighty-six. Yeah, that's 85, surprising. 86. It sounds so much quieter. Yeah, it yeah. does. Precise. I'm gonna hit it this way so you can see the. Eighty-six, eighty-seven. 87. Okay, that's what I saw. Okay, this is the Vario W, but all the Varios are gonna be the same. Loudest so far, up to about 91, 92. Well, yeah, I saw that. And I made it get copy all over my timer. <laughs> my decibel machine. The makeup. Yeah. Ninety. Ninety. All right. Mm -hmm. All right. So recap. Recap on this grinder noise situation. We have three dead heats: the Ranchilio Rocky, the K3 Touch. By Compact and the Breville Smart Grinder, all okay. at 85 decibels. And that's uh, it's based. That's 40 decibels above our ambient room. Yes. Yes. Okay. Exactly. And then uh, 87 is the Preciso. Okay. 88. We have two contenders there: the Pro M by Malconig and the MCI by Nuovo Simonelli. Okay. And then um, we got two 90s: the Mini Mazer and the Macap. Okay. And the big noise in the room <laughs> kind of surprised me. The Vario at 92. Now, so it's from 85 to 92. Well, and that's really 40 to 
47 yes. decibels exactly. as far as um, uh, the well, straight measurement. But what we noticed is tone differences that kind of made some of them seem like they would be louder. Exactly. Some of them, we were like, you're kidding. Yeah. Or just vice versa. Some of them sounded quieter and Ended they up came being... up, the noise, the noise level was a little higher. Yeah. So really at the end of the day. <laughs> I mean, it was really, it was really basically like a, um, a seven decibel difference yeah, between all of them. For me, I would go for which one is going to be, have the best quality of grind, yeah. reliability, uh, how are the, are the beans going to flow through it, all different, and doser, no doser, those things are probably more important than the decibel level. So this is, I mean, obviously we're not scientists and we didn't get some crazy readings, so you know, this is obviously the Seattle Coffee Gear practical yeah, it's approach. My, it's my iPhone. <laughs> it's iPhone. We had it placed in the same place every time though, so. Yeah, we put it right in front of each one of the grinders. Yeah. And so the, the and the ambient noise in the room stayed the same. It was mm -hmm. about 45 decibels when we started every time. We called cool. the people in the back to shh. I shocked. <laughs> <laughs> and they did. They did. All right. Yeah. Well, thank you, Gail. You're welcome.